We're group 11. I'm Kara. And I'm Hannah. Hi, I'm Maddie. And I'm Dudley. Welcome to our capstone project. We were teamed up with United Equipment Accessories, who specializes in slip rings and rotary engines. These allow transmission of electrical current and hydraulic fluid through rotating joints. For example, this is used in the wind industry so the turbine blades can rotate while the tower stays stationary. And so for our project, we assisted with their age cut line, which is the very first step of the production process where they cut the, the wires for the harnesses. Our objectives were to increase throughput on the age cut lines first shift by 33%, resulting in a reduction of collective labor hours and minimizing second shift. Additionally, to evaluate ergonomics and organizations to aid in safety and cross-training of the operators. Time studies were conducted over three days, and during that time, it was discovered that 17% of the cumulative time was value-added, which means that they're actually cutting the wire. 10% of that time was non-value-added, and 73% of the time was non-value-added when necessary. And of that cumulative time, 22.8% of the time, the operators were spending actually just taping and wiring, taping the wires. This is the current state layout with over 800 different wire types. Our team did an analysis in Excel to see where the current high volume spools are being stored and found that high volume and low volume spools are mixed together and that spools are easily obscured on the shelves causing delays. Whoa, whoa, whoa stop right there. At UEA, safety is the number one priority. Our team conducted a rapid entire body analysis as well as a rapid upper limb analysis to understand the ergonomic risks associated with manually loading a spool into a machine. Based on our assessment, this is a high risk action that we need to mitigate to ensure the safety for all operators. Recommendation one, additional racking and shelving. Based on the results of layout analysis, time study, and ergonomic analysis, the team decided to transfer the three highest use spools to barrels and add three new barrel carts. With this, space is created to add three racks designed by the team, which collectively hold 27 spools. This benefit is twofold. Decreasing the number of changeovers that require manual spool loading will save time and minimize ergonomic strain. Recommendation two, new shelf layout and shelf fixtures. The next recommendation is a new layout incorporating the new carts and racks. This layout prioritizes the high use spools while increasing the linear feet of accessible shelf space by 18.5%. With this new layout, shelving fixtures will also be implemented, which will increase visibility of the spools and prevent spools from becoming lost and being pushed to the backs of the shelves. As the time study showed, 22.8% was spent taping the wires together before sending them to the next station. UEA ordered a twist tie device to test, and the results showed an 85% decrease in bundling time. This is just the beginning of the time and money savings journey. The estimated three-year ROI is over $212,000, and the payback period is just one month. Additionally, these changes create a safer process, avoiding potential workplace injuries. These changes will support UEA's continued growth by creating an organized and accessible HK area. From, From Team 11, 11 thanks, thanks for watching! watching.